All right, we out here at Pink's Hot Dog, L.A. Legend. It says a Hollywood legend. Best doggone hot dog on the planet since 1939. Can't wait. Come on. We're excited. We out here. You see the theming? It's pink. It's hot dog. Let's Let's go. go. Dogs is a Hollywood landmark and has been since 1939. This hot dog stand serves over 2,000 hot dogs and 200 hamburgers each and every day. Pink's was started in 1939 by Paul and Betty Pink with a push cart they purchased for $50, which they had to borrow from Betty's mother. And this historic landmark with delicious hot dogs still brings lines of people each and every day. The Pink Family has created over 35 combinations of hot dogs and a dozen varieties of hamburgers to satisfy everyone's hot dog dreams come true. Pink's is located near major Hollywood studios like Paramount, Universal, and Disney, and started to attract up and coming and established movie and TV stars. Pink's Celebrity Wall of Fame in the dining room started as a place for aspiring actors to hang their photos, to be discovered by producers and directors who were known to dine at Pink's. Today, Pink's dining room is filled with over 200 photos of celebrities with signed endorsements of their pure enjoyment of Pink's hot dogs. Let's take a look outside at the beautiful patio with lots of pink and red and white umbrellas. Enjoy the wonderful California sunshine as we dig in to these amazing hot dogs. Okay, we've talked about Pink's and the location and the celebrities that come here, but let's really talk about these hot dogs. Absolutely fantastic. Covered in as many different toppings as you can even imagine. So many of the varieties are named after the celebrities and their unique uh, toppings they like. We absolutely loved it. So good. I definitely recommend eating them with a fork and a knife. (laughs) Dylan challenged himself to not use the utensils, but they are so packed with delicious toppings. It's really hard. (laughs) But let's take a look. Um, Look at these. I know I got the... Drew Barrymore, which had bacon and chili and cheese. And then uh, one of us got the barbecue and onion rings and we got the fajita fries. Dylan got the Philly cheesesteak hot dog. Everything was absolutely amazingly delicious. Definitely recommend that you visit one of their 13 locations in Los Angeles. Um, They also have cake, save room for cake. We got some to go. The chocolate cake was amazing. They also have in-house made coconut cake, which was so delicious. I actually would take a bite of each one and put them together and the chocolate and the coconut together. Absolutely amazing. It was like a Mounds bar. So good. All right, we're leaving Pink's. That was amazing. It, I mean, it lives up to the hype. It is so good. Um, everything, is so good. everything was really good. Customer service was great. Jalen got a T-shirt. Everything was really reasonably priced here. Uh, no complaints. Uh, we had a local come up to us and tell us uh, what he orders, and that ended up being the best thing we had, I think. Uh, uh, my mom got the the Drew Barrymore. That was super oh, good. Oh my god! How was he now? Foot long hot dog, chili and cheese and crisp bacon. I love the very bacon crispy was so bacon. Crisp, and it was just such a great combination of flavors. Oh, so good. 
So we got the like mahala and it had mushrooms, onions. We got a spicy Polish sausage and added pastrami. And wow, and that flavor packed. Do yourself a favor and order that. Yes, Jalen loved the onion rings. Uh, everything was super good here. So um, definitely suggest pinks. Thank you so much for coming along with us as we went to Pink's in Hollywood, California. Let us know in the comments below if you've ever been to Pink's and what you thought of this video. If you're new here, please hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so that you never miss anything the Mickey Bunch or any of our adventures. Is it recording?